Hey, it's Camping Cast with Smith RV in Casper, Wyoming. It has been a while since we've posted a video, so we wanted to come back at you with a 2024 Arctic Fox 25R. This thing totally got a new lease on life. They got a new dinette option in this thing with some theater seating, and they nailed it, in my opinion. This has been a staple in the Northwood lineup since the early 2000s, and it's basically been unchanged since then, but now they have an option to make that a little bit better. Well, let's take a look at this thing and see the differences of what makes a Northwood unit a Northwood unit. So this floor plan is one of only a few that gives you a built-in generator box. So this is prepped and ready uh, for a built-in generator. So that is super nice. We have power stabilizer jacks that we take as an option on this unit. You're going to see just a little bit of lift on this. Does, does pretty good. Uh, we like this. This is a, a lot better than the scissor style jacks on it. Uh, let's see. We have Goodyear endurance tires on this, 15 inch wheels. And another classic Northwood, we have shocks on all four wheels of this. You're not going to find shocks on very many units out there. So that definitely enhances the ride on the unit. Another classic Northwood, metal lined uh, wheel wells. And then we have fender skirts that are very, uh, very strong. Not very prone to breaking, made out of very durable plastic, opposed to most manufacturers use a inexpensive ABS style um, plastic. So on our power awning, we have an LED light strip in the tube on this. So you do have to put the awning out all the way to, to enjoy that. But at nighttime, it looks awesome with the light bouncing off the side of the trailer. So we have optioned this with the Solex uh, power, uh, solar power package on this thing. Uh, so we have 400 watts of solar on board this, so great, uh, great stuff there. Thermal pane frameless windows. We got this new Moride solid step, so as represented, super solid. They, they keep making them a little bit lighter and easier to fold up and down, so I think that is great. Kind of cool the way those flip. Yeah, entry door assist handle, fresh water fill tank there, uh, 68 gallons of fresh water on board with a 10 gallon water heater. Let's check out our front here. We have our pass through storage. It is a straight pass through across that is lighted from both sides, which is super nice. And we have our inch thick insulated compartment doors with slam latch magnetic catches. So coming around the front here, we have a fiberglass front cap, super strong. And we have some coating on the bottom to protect from the stones. Now Northwood has done these uh, extra tall uh, power tongue jacks on these. So definitely with today's modern pickups, uh, be a lot less apt to have to use, a, uh, use blocks and stuff to get on the truck. A lot taller of a jack than most. We also have nice little built-in uh, safety chain holders and a holder for the seven-way. The two 30-pound propane tanks. Come around the side here, you can see Northwood's got a super nice little inset battery rack that will cradle uh, two 24-group deep cycle batteries, or you could maybe do some six volts or something on board. So come around over to the utility side. We have just a little bit of uh, storage that will be under a part of that uh, booth dinette, so a little extra storage there. See under our slide out, this is a Schwintec slide system on this. Coming around to the back here, back to the utilities. We have access to some stuff back here that is the uh, transfer switch for the uh, for the generator providing you do one and a little additional storage there love when northwood uh, still hanging on to doing the built-in power cord uh holder so that you don't have to find a place for it elsewhere you just stuff it all up in there and call it good and then when, when you're out camping you have uh you can kind of just 
put that right in there and uh, have it all locked up nice. I have an LED light, so if you're doing all this in the dark, it makes it a lot better. Coming through the underbelly here, classic Northwood form, uh, straight dump pull valves, no cables on these things, so it's gonna last a lot longer. And just straight poles. You'll notice those dump valves are enclosed in the underbelly that are enclosed in each individual holding tank area that is heated by three different foxholes from the furnace. Definitely the best way to heat an underbelly. Uh, doing holding tank heat pads is definitely not as effective as running the furnace. So Northwood definitely does a great job there um, in that department. Uh, everyone always asks what these are. These are just test wires for the holding tank sensors. All right, let's come around the back side here. They got the nice uh, fat ladder here. Uh, diamond plate wrap on the bumper and an accessory rear receiver hitch uh, there. We got our 10 gallon suburban water heater and uh, let's uh, go check out the roof. There's our Solex 400 watt solar package. Nice big skylight and three premium fan vents. guys welcome aboard the 2024 arctic fox 25r again as i represented outside this thing got a total new lease on life so northwood optioned gave, gave us an option of this nice little uh, mini dinette so as far as like width in the seat and the backs of it, it is all the same as a normal booth dinette it is just uh, for two instead of four it is just for two but great option here for eating and that makes way for this bad boy of a sofa uh, in the slide so we have all the way across options flip this down we got that as an option and we got theater seating and i'm telling you this is so good so this is a great option it's straight across from the tv uh, so you're not going to be cranking ahead of any fashion. And I really think um, that people are going to love this new arrangement. All right, let's keep, uh, let's keep trucking here. So run vinyl flooring up into the bedroom, but then it turns to carpet. So we do have carpet with pads. So when you're getting out of bed in the mornings, you will have the warmth of that carpet. We've got our queen bed here. We've got nice little pillows here. This is the new interior color. I think this is called Moonstone. So that's uh, brand new for 2024. Northwood doesn't change colors very often. So I think you guys will love that color. So under our bed, you get the Arctic Fox throw blanket. You get two Arctic Fox director chairs. And we have struts on here, solid plywood. You're not gonna find any chipboard in a Northwood unit. Got nice little roller shades on the windows. And we got fantastic fans. These, I think they call them premium fans now. So uh, in and out, rain sensing, large fans. And uh, I believe that's thermostatically controlled as well. So lots of storage here. Got nice built-ins, 110 outlets, 110s. And we have USBs on each side of those as well. This is kind of great. We have we got the laundry chute. You guys see my clothes basket down there, so I can throw my clothes down in there and out of the coat. Nice little cathedral arch ceiling in here. We have R18 bad insulation with a layer of R15 astrofoil. So uh, no one does it quite like Northwood, guys. All of our switches here, generator start switch if you do one. Back to that, uh, no one does it like Northwood. Check, check the depth of that ceiling. No one really does them like this because they don't do it like, uh, like Northwood. Coming over, solid surface countertops. And we have classic Northwood stainless 50-50 sink, industrial faucets. All right, uh, we have a Furion three burner cooktop. Decent size oven in there. And 
like the safety indicators of the different colors of uh, turns to red. I mean, when it uh, when the gas is flowing, so great safety precaution there. So adjustable shelves in here, so you can kind of uh, do what you do what you want. Now we do have a, a Norcold uh, 10 cubic foot 12 volt refrigerator on board this. So with 400 watts of solar and some good batteries on board, that's going to keep everything fed. The really great thing about 12 volt refrigerators, you usually gain about two extra cubic foot of storage and they cool down in two to three hours, opposed to a day or two, depending on how hot it is outside with uh, a gas electric. All right, co come on into the bathroom. So they carry on with the solid surface countertops. Nice little single handle there. Carrying on with the uh, uh, premium fans throughout the whole coach. I want you guys to check out the big wardrobe we got in this thing. So this thing's, uh, this thing's a beauty. So ton of storage space in there. And then we got our foot flush commode and porcelain. So porcelain's nice, helps easier to clean. And then pretty standard shower on board. Nice little shower screen. And I think most people are going to find that uh, the height's pretty good. My head is up into the skylight. I'm six foot three and I got my boots on today, but still got room to work and get the job done. Nice little soap holder and pretty good size handle for this. So shower off there. So that is good. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed walking through the 2024 uh, Artifox 25R. We're Smith RV located in Casper, Wyoming. Always appreciate uh, you guys watching. Uh, like the video, uh, comment, uh, ring the bell for future videos coming out at you. You guys have an awesome day. Thanks.